if you are facing the easy anti-cheat internal error, here is a video where I'll show you some simple steps to fix this problem. Now I did get this issue even on my computer as well and I found out a very easy kind of fix for this. It was quite simple though there can be various steps which are required in order for you to do so if the first step doesn't fix it. So the first and foremost thing which you have to do is to update your graphics driver to the latest version. If you're using a graphics driver which is very very old and you haven't updated it yet even if the latest version is available, I would highly recommend you to do that first and foremost because a lot of players after having the latest driver they are not facing this issue. So this is the first thing you have to do whether it's AMD or Nvidia. Make sure to update your graphics driver to the latest. Next step what you have to do in the search bar you have to type in run and over here you have to type the command percentage app data percentage. This particular command and click ok. Once app data loads you have to go to roaming. In here you will find the folder easy anti cheat. Just select this and permanently delete it. Once it is deleted from there you have to go to your Fortnite directory, Fortnite game, binaries, win64. You're gonna find another folder which is the easy anti-cheat. Make sure to select this and just permanently delete it. Once it is done, you have to go to the search bar again and type run one more time. And this time you have to press the command reg edit or reg edit and click OK. Now when you open it for the very first time, this is how it's gonna look. What basically you have to do here is you have to go to edit, go to find and type the command easy anti-cheat, give a underscore and type BOS and make sure values and data are untick. Only the keys should be checked and click on find next. So basically it will try to find that folder which is having the easy anti-cheat EOS and even all the other keys which are there in the registry files. You can do this with some uninstallers as well which are found in the market. Make sure they are capable of deleting even the registry keys as well. If you can find those kind of uninstallers, it's perfectly fine. You can download and uninstall easy anti-cheat. It will remove everything. If not, you have to do this manual step. Once you have found the folder, right click and just simply delete it. Once it is deleted, whenever you launch the game, it will automatically install easy anti-cheat and you can play your game without any problems. Next step, basically this issue is happening due to some different kind of antivirus systems. If you have any kind of antivirus software, there are so many in the market, even if it's a free one, even if it's a paid one. If you are not capable enough to put an exception to easy anti-cheat, then I would recommend you to just temporarily turn off your antivirus software just in order for the game to run. And once the game runs, you can turn it on again. And even if you have your Windows Defender on, I would recommend you to turn it off just for a couple of seconds and then try to launch your game, see if you're still getting the error. If you're still getting the error, you can try both the previous steps and then you can see whether it works or not. Next step what you can try here is if you don't want to try the second step of deleting or easy anti-cheat then basically what you have to do you can go to your Fortnite directory. So in the Fortnite directory you go to Fortnite game, binaries, win64 and easy anti-cheat. They're gonna find the easy anti-cheat EOS setup. I'm gonna right click and open but I'm pretty sure it's not gonna open over here and if it does for you as well it's perfectly fine then what you do is and for some player if it opens over here then you can stay over here and do the step but if it's not opening go to the c drive and the c drive the program files which is the x86 make sure this is the folder double click and open it go to the easy anti-cheat not the eos just the easy anti-cheat double click and open it you're gonna find the application open this application i can choose the game both games have different kind of codes i have only two games installed which use easy anti-cheat i'm gonna choose this and simply click on repair service you can uninstall it as well and then install again and then you can try the game, see if that helps. Now this may not be a permanent fix. Eventually it's gonna fix once or twice and then the issue is gonna come back. So I would recommend you to try the second step, which is of how to delete the easy anti-cheat and then the registry files and also not to use any kind of antivirus system. And then you can try your game, see if that helps. So that was pretty basic. Hope this helped you. And if you're still facing the issue, do put down in the comment section or you can go to my X handle, put a screenshot. Don't forget to tag me. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.